uh, give us a second we will just check out if everything works today guys uh, i have a pleasure to host for you official ancestors legacy community uh, tournament uh, i'm scream watson i'm the community manager uh, from destructive creations and guys with me today on discord is my friend uh, svetrovsky svetrovsky introduce yourself hello guys pleasure all mine yeah, guys, give us a second. We will just check out if everything works on the OBS side and if the broadcast is OK. Uh, give me a second. I see that, unfortunately, you will be able to watch broadcast today only in 1080p. Uh, but I hope so. It's not the big issue. Unfortunately, my OBS or our Twitch account is not allowing us to broadcast in lower quality. But as I said, I hope so. Uh, it will be OK. Okay, so guys, uh, at the beginning uh, with Svetrovsky, we want to say thank you uh, to every beautiful person, every beautiful soul uh, who was participating in our community tournament. Um, I will not read all of the nicknames, guys, but you can see lads which were fighting brave for the victory over here uh, and on the right side of our ladder as well. Obviously, guys, our ladder you can find as well on our official Discord server. Um, and today we will take care only about the finals as we uh, were discussing that on a discord you wanted us to broadcast it you wanted to see how the finals will look like so we are coming to you with finals uh, you will be able guys to watch match for the third place and match for the um, first place um, for the victory and guys uh, unfortunately uh, our finalists uh, were from the different regions uh, we had someone from the Australia, I think so, Svetrovsky, right? From Poland right. Uh, and um, from Holland, Netherlands. And yeah, I think so. So, you know, guys, uh, our participants were from uh, different time zones. Uh, we had problems with setting up the dates uh, which will fit our players. So um, we did it, We fixed it like that, that the match uh, for the third place uh was played yesterday um we recorded it uh and we will play highlights for you so you will be able to see who won the match for the third place between dbg and steelbeard um soon we will uh retransmit, uh, retransmit it and after that we will go uh for the live match uh between kakaos manden and frazowski this match will be played um live um do you want to add something uh, Svetrovsky before we will go uh to the red transmission I have to admit that I cannot wait for the final match the players uh, are superb they play really really well and I really really can't wait to see them live oh yeah that's true that's true to be honest it was because together with Svetrovsky we were watching Steelbeard and DBG it was uh, very entertaining as well so can't wait to uh, show you the highlight guys uh, and obviously as Svetrovsky mentioned can't wait to uh, see who will win in the fight between Kakaos Manden and Frezovsky so guys okay uh, without expanding that any further we are going for highlights from the match um for the third place uh enjoy guys enjoy check out who won dbg or steelbeard enjoy guys
Okay, guys, as you could see, congratulations for DBG, uh, for the glorious victory over Steelbeard. Um, he defeated Vikings with the Germans and uh, took the third place in the tournament, guys. Uh, and right now, we are moving directly towards the finale of the finale uh, for the match of the, um, the first place between Kakao's Maiden, who will play with Germans, and Frezowski, who will play Slavs. Guys, we are lucky. Everybody is already in a lobby, so we will, ha we will have no delay on the match uh so basically uh we were thinking with uh svetrovsky that we will have to wait for the boys but they are already here so we can move uh directly on to the final uh between kakao's maiden and frezovsky so let's go guys let's check out who will achieve the first place creme de la creme creme de la creme exactly let's go Who you are cheering for, Mr. Svetrovsky? Cause Slavs. Slavs? Slav myself. Yeah, and Frezowski is from Poland as well, so... <laughs> yeah. And where the Kakao's Manden is from? Do you remember? Mm, not really, nope. Ah, okay. And we already have Germans on the third place, so it will be cool if this finale uh, will be won by Slavs. We are so biased. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Come on, Svetrovsky, everybody's waiting for you. Nice. Okay. So it's happening. The grand final of our community tournament. Similar start for both players. Nothing surprising at the beginning, I see. No one is rushing. Kakao's a little bit faster. Do you think so? Yeah, yeah, a little bit. But, like, literally, a tiny, tiny level faster. Okay. Where is Kakao heading to right now? Okay, B. B. Barracks finished for Frazowski. Yeah. We already seen it on the second finale that Rudolf won, uh, which is the hero of the German, is very powerful. To be honest, uh, on the second finale, Rudolf was able to kill the entire Spearman unit from Slavs. Or no, from Vikings. Yeah, from Vikings. I do not know what about uh, Boleslav, if he's that powerful as well. Oh no, look, uh, Rezovsky is skipping on C, he's going directly for middle. Oh, very bold movement. Yeah. Oh. And the second unit looks like he will scout B right now. I guess so. Yeah. Germans are still on two units. Oh, and look at, at Rudolf. At Rudolf? Okay. He was checking the grass. Ah. <laughs> Ludo Rudolf likes grass. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, I think so Kaka was misclicked. You seen it? Nope. Because he weren't capturing, he was just like running around the warehouse. So he lost a little bit of time. Okay, we have like the third unit from Germans. Frazowski setting up traps. Oh, in a pretty cheeky position. Nice, nice. The second unit for Germans. Ah, uh, I'm counting the uh, hero as well. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. I'm wondering if Frezowski will leave someone to guard middle, but nah, it's not looking like. 
What factions are they, Frenzy? Germans and Slavs. Prezovsky is playing Slavs, blue player, and the red one, Kakaos Manden, is playing Germans. Germans are right now on one, one unit of Spearmans, one unit of Machete, and Mr. Rudolf 1. Slavs on four units, two Shieldmans, uh, Boleslav, and over here, Spears. Oh, very, very bold. Oh, look, 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 he's going in a trap. Yeah. No, he skipped it. He skipped it. He skipped yeah. it. <laughs> oh, nice. Oh, look, yeah. Brzezowski just... Look Brzezowski, yeah. It looks like he's sacrificing middle. For the D. Yeah. And we have another spew warband for Brzezowski. But Kakao's Maiden recruited right now Spearmans, but... Seems like he is not even planning to defend the D with them. And he's pretty pretty spread with, uh, with his units. Yep. Okay, Frazowski is heading to B right now, and probably he will, yeah, he will send those Spearmans to protect A, looks like. And it may be, it I, may be enough to, to stop the... I don't... Uh, we will see. Yeah, Rudolf is pretty, lo pretty low on health. Same as his Spearmans. Yeah, yep. Exactly. Yep. Look, Frazowski defended it. Nice play, nice play. Yeah. He has D and right now he is... And D look at B. Yep, I'm checking on it right now. Yeah, he will destroy it. The, the, the charge for Cleaver Infantry with his hero. Yep. Nice. Well played. And looks like right now with Shieldmans, he's going back to D, probably to recruit uh, those two units which he lost. Okay, and his hero is staying on B. Yeah, I think so Boleslav will deal with those Machiti ones. But Rudolf isn't coming. Ah, yeah, cheeky Rudolf. <laughs> Kakaos is cooking something mish... Okay, okay. We trust you. Okay. Another shield warband from Frezowski. Okay, two Panzer Spearmen, three Panzer Spearmen un units. No, uh, two. Okay. Uh, in base, I'm blind. And Rudolf joined the fight on B. Okay. Do you think so Frezowski will finish that uh, clever infantry? Well, we'll see. Mm. No, I think so his... Boleslav starts attacking Rudolf. Yeah, he will not finish the infantry. Yeah, he'll probably retreat. Okay, but Frezowski is... Losing you need no 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 he's not losing it. Well he may be losing it as he's running near the towers. So Nah look at it. Lucky uh, one. Lucky bastard. bastard. I don't I don't very nice guerrilla attack. Yep. Okay, but meanwhile Frezowski is capturing another uh, warehouse. And as we all know, Germany is very resource dependent. Okay, Kakao is skipping on D. Seems like he's going for B with those Spearmans. Yep. Oh no, no, he's just flanking. And Kakao's just built a catapult. Oh, for real? Okay. But look at the map. It seems completely yeah. blue. Okay, Kakao's almost lost Rudolf. And look! Look, Boleslav won with the infantry and with Rudolf. He yep. beat all of them. Oh my gosh, what a 
bloody powerful hero. It's level 2 already. Rudolf is still 1. And what's happening on D? Okay, shield warban is trying to defend it, but... And the catapult is there. Yep. The warehouse is already down. Okay, Frazowski built a tower, but it's already down as well. And he lost that unit. Yep. But look how big a resource generation he has. So one unit is nothing. And he built archery range. So. Okay. But I can't see any archers yet. Yet, yep. Yep. But soon. Yep. Soon enough. What is the most powerful unit from Slavs? Hmm. Well, I generally like the shield warband. Mm hmm. Uh, and possibilities of this unit. Okay. Seems like Frazowski as well. He has a lot of those. Or at least he started with a lot of those. Very, very decent unit to be Yeah. Honest. Okay, Slavic archers are going on B. Yep. But seems like Kakaos is preparing tanky strategy. He's just making like one big powerful Zerg. To demolish with it. Okay, catapult is going. What else do we have? Another Panzer Spearmans. And stables for Frazowski. Okay. Yeah, right now Frazowski has such a big advantage with the resources that he can invest in tech. Okay, Boleslav is engaging Panzer Spearmans. And it's not going that easy as it was with the infantry. Yeah. Kaka is the Lord of Lords, okay. I see that Kaka's maiden have a lot of uh, cheerleaders today. Great fan base. Yeah. Okay. Another Spear Warband for Frazowski. Okay. And he's still keeping the shield warband in the in his base. Yeah, I see it. Around the barracks, you mean, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I, I, I think so. He forgot about it, or at least that's how it looks like. Or maybe he's preparing some mysterious strategy, you know. Okay, Frazowski is probably losing Boleslav, and this will be like a massive thing. Yeah, Boleslav is dead. Yeah. Well played. We know, Sega, we know. And we are happy about it, to be honest. Good to have you guys. Okay. I'm not that good Ancestor's Legacy player, but I think so. Uh, the Boleslav was a part of powerful unit. Like, Brzezowski will miss him a lot. Yeah. Oh, look, he finally moved those uh, shield warbands. Hope it's not too late. Yeah. Okay. He's regrouping in the main base. And Kakao's Maiden is slowly stabiliz uh, stabilizing the situation. Like, he capped D. Right now, he capped... Uh, yeah, he capped it. And he's going for A. Okay, Frazowski's hiding in a grass. Oh, and... Rudolf 1 is going for it. Look at that. He'll be surrounded. Whoa. Surrounded. Oh, yeah. The question is, if dead. Yeah. Oh, he's retreating. Yeah, and looks like Kaka is, is retreating from A to B. Yep. Oh, but look at that.
the Panzer Spearman Ambush. Okay. And we have mounted archers, yeah, as well. The catapult slowly moving towards A. Oh. Okay, so Kakao's Maiden is multi tasking. He's fighting on two fronts. Protecting B and attacking A, right? I'm wondering building archer range in his base. Yeah. I'm wondering if Rezovski He's not even planning to defend A. As far as I see. Yeah. He's focusing mainly on B to destroy the main forces of Kakao's Maiden. But still, three units, maybe, doing nothing. Yeah, yeah. I think so, Frazowski is a little bit worse in the mi microing. Yeah. Kakao is managing his uh, units perfectly. Keeping them busy. Exactly. It looks for me like Frazowski had a, an idea for, for a start. And it just didn't went uh, as as he as he planned. Yep. But Germans are playing German strategy. You know, bunker up, build like powerful forces, and destroy your enemy. Where is cavalry? Yeah, still waiting for it. But you know, right now he is operating on three bases, A, D, and B, so soon we will see it, I think so. But I feel like Frazowski didn't say his last word yet. Dismounted archers, if he will micro with them correctly, can be a game changer. Oh, and the rip catapult. Oh, that's a big loss. few more shots. Oh, I'm... Yeah, yeah, he finished it. Exactly, that's what I'm talking about. Microwing with them. Okay, another shield warband is coming. Another shield warband. Slavic archers are... And crossbowmen incoming. To sleeping eight. in the main base. Frazowski wake them up. Okay. Crossbowmen on the Kakao's oh. Manden side. Ooh, the entire unit dies because I haven't seen it. Okay. Three, three guys. Oh, but look, Rudolf is dying, I think so. Yeah. With the mounted archers here, I think so. Krasowski should finish it. Yeah, but uh, he'll got time to get his uh, spearmans. Yeah. To the fight, probably. Yeah, to flank. Okay, another archers are joining. And Rudolf is still alive. Yeah. But again, we have the same situation and we as we had at the beginning, that Kakao's units are so spreaded. But... Surprisingly, Frazowski is not using these archers. Okay, right now. Exactly. That's what I was waiting for. Shoot at their backs. Yep. Okay, cutting the reinforces with the spear warband. Good idea. Ooh, and right now, Frozovsky is getting surrounded. Yep. Okay, but he will kill that level 2 Panzer Spearman unit. Good job. But I'm not that sure if it was worth it. Ooh. Rudolf the Brave Man. Level 3. <laughs> nice. Yep. But look, um, okay, he's chasing the units, not focusing Rudolf, okay. 
what else is waiting in a base? Slavic archers and cavalry we have. Okay. Okay, Rudolf is trying to run away, but I don't think so. He no! <laughs> oh, he died. He died. Okay. It was just probably the lag on my side. Level 3, Rudolf down. And the regular cavalry is also... It's coming already? No, he's... Yep, it's approaching. Okay. Cavalry. Ah. Oh, yeah, I see that. Oh. Ooh! Nice. Those bows paid off. But pretty nice counter from Kakao's Manden's side, oh, I think so. Yeah. I really like his move. Like, he sees a lot of mounted archers from the Frazowski side, so he goes for those crossbows. And it works pretty well right now. Okay, but Panzer Spearmen are dead. What's coming next? Oh, where are you going, little boy? Spearman Warband. I think so, Frazowski forgot to just fix that unit. One brave warrior. Yeah, one brave warrior. Maybe he's sending it as a scout. Oh yeah, that's how it looks like. He will just scout with it. Or maybe not. I don't know. I'm not sure. Okay. Kakaos mounted the abandoned uh, catapult. And finally we have stables for Kakao. Nice. Okay, Spear Warband is going sneaky bicky like for B. Yeah, he was baiting with that unit. That's how it looks like, look. And he's chasing the Panzer Cavalry right now with mounted archers. And that Panzer Cavalry have no... Ooh, look at that beautiful trap from Frazowski's side. Ah, he will miss it with those Spearmans. Yeah. yeah. So close. That was a pretty nice. And we have one lonely crossbowman unit approaching C. Yep, see it. And probably really, really soon a big fight in the middle is coming. Do you think so that uh Rezovsky is going for a full big army of mounted archers. I don't know. Oh! Ooh! Yep. Oh, and look, they are still going with the catapult. Okay, mounted archers are going to defend C, I think so. Ooh, and look, they will fa they will kill the catapult. Yup. But the catapult approaches C. Oh. Single shot. C is down. And Panzer Cavalry approaching. Mm -mm -mm. The crossbows hide them in the grass. Dealing massive damage to that mounted archers. That's gonna hurt. Yep. Frazowski, Spear Warband, and Spear Warband is heading to C, I think so, and the big crossbow company coming there as well. Okay, but for now, Frazowski is stabilizing situation here. Okay, Frazowski is going for a catapult. With the Spear Warband. Oh, he, he, he even tried to capture that. Do you think so he will land a single shot on A? Look at the C, look at the C. Okay, what's happening on C? Ooh, okay. Cavalry against Cavalry. And the crossbows, man. <laughs> crossbows. <laughs> Still waiting in the grass. Very nice poke. Yep. Kakao started like a turtle. But this strategy seems to work. Yeah. 
I'm wondering what Frezovsky is planning right now. Yeah. He's slowly getting pushed back. One base after another. I think his main mistake was when he tried to uh, attack the tower uh, of the Kakao's base. True, true. Too soon. Yeah, you are right. I think so that at the beginning, when he was managing probably every base except D or B, uh, he should take careful steps to do not lose any unit against Kakao, to just use that economy to recruit more soldiers and then hit Germans hard. Exactly. But he lost a lot of shieldmans in uh, multiple stupid fights, and right now we can see the result. And also Bolesław. Yeah. And everyone knows that, that when Germans are on, like, a big economy, like right now, and have... Uh, like a high resource army, it's really hard to just encounter them with any other nation. He's so fed up now. Yeah. Four units of crossbowmen. Okay, Frazowski is approaching A. How will Kakaos react on it? Fight for the catapult at the gate. Yep. Good idea, because single shot uh, from this position uh, could destroy C. And right now, big fight on A. Okay, Kakaos is losing Panzer Spearmans immediately at the beginning of the fight. Yeah. Oh, but look at those Spear Warband on front lane. Demolished by the crossbows. Oh! Oh my gosh, okay. Brzezowski is retreating. And only E for him. Oh, but look what he's doing. Can you see that tiny blue dot on the right side of the map? <laughs> <laughs> he's going for B. He's getting squeezed from every side. But I'm surprised, to be honest. Kakaos is so precise in every move that I'm so surprised that he's not scouting that right side of the map and he didn't realize that the catapult is approaching his B right now. Well, he has three units of cavalry? Yep. Yeah. So he can easily... Destroy it. Yeah, yeah. But I'm just speaking about scouting, you know. But seems like right now he knows that he can... He's not counting losses. He can just recruit one unit after another. And I think so right now the most important units in his army are those crossbows on level 2s and upgraded. These guys are working perfectly against the mounted archers. Yeah. Okay, but Frozovsky with the sneaky move is trying to turn this. And another shot from the catapult. Yup, it's landing on a warehouse. Yup. Okay, but meanwhile, Kakao's captured bottom warehouse, and right now it's going for a main base. I think so. Indeed. Yeah, they traded. Frozowski traded A for B, but he. To be honest, right now he traded B for his home base. <laughs> yeah. Or. That's how it looks like.
Oh, but Kakaos is not engaging it yet. Ah, look at it. Oof. Yep, yep. Oh, it's coming. Yep, you're right. But meanwhile, he almost lost the entire Panzer Cavalry unit. He'll heal up and he'll strike. Yeah. That's what's happening right now. The final stand of Mr. Frazowski. Stables are in fire. And what's not in fire right now in his base? Okay, archery range is going down. Tables is going down. The question is if Townhall will survive. Is the catapult up? Yes. And even protected by the crossbows. Beautiful. Spearmans are trying to go back to defend the hometown. That looks like it's not enough. The whole base is burning. Basically. It's a G G. I think so he must recognize the superiority of Kakao's men there on that first map, Mr. Frazowski. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, Mr. Sekirido, look at the Frazowski units right now. I'm admiring them, how brave those soldiers are, but... You know... GG! Map 1 is landing in the pocket of Mr. Kakao's Manden. Do you think so, guys, that Mr. Trezovsky will turn the tide or Mr. Kakao's Manden will gain 2-0 score after the next second map? Okay, guys, wait. Right now, I just have to join the lobby again. Or, wait. No, I can't just continue to join the lobby. So, I have to wait for the invitation uh, from Mr. Kakaos Manden. Give me a second. <clears throat> Are you in, Svetlovsky? Yep. Can you send me the invitation? Maybe it'll be clearer. Thank you so much. Because I'm lonely. Out of the lobby. <laughs> There you go. Thank you so much. We are going back. Not gonna lie, I'm crossing my fingers so much for Mr. Frazowski. I would love to see three maps. Yeah, three map horror. And I'm wondering who chose collateral damage. Is it Kakao's map or is it Frazowski map? Yeah, Frazowski's. Oh, it's Frazowski map. Okay. Let's go then. I feel that he will turn the tie on this map. Not gonna lie, he played really well in the first well, half of the first map. Yep. German crossbows destroyed almost all of Franzowski units. Yep, Frenzy. Exactly. That's how it was. Boleslav the Brave. He seems to be pretty important for Frazowski. He did like such a good job in the previous match. Okay, slowly beginning from both players. The only difference is that uh, Kakaos is going for the closest uh, village and uh, Frazowski is going, expanding a little bit closer to the mid.
Are you here, Mr. Svetrovsky? Because I can't hear you. Okay, you are here. I was worrying about you. I'm just so focused. Ah, okay. And again. So you should participate in the next tournament. First base for Frozovsky. Yeah, sure. Base, first base for Frozovsky? You're sure? No, for Kakao. Kakao is capturing first. Yep. Oh, yeah. Sorry. You should definitely drink some coffee, Mr. Svetrovsky. They, they change colors. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And again, you can see that that Frezovsky is sleeping a little bit. Kakaos is all the time keeping his units busy, as I said before. Oh, but that's pretty interesting situation. Like, um, Frezovsky... Yeah, he's expanding towards middle. Kakao is, again, playing the turtle strategy, I think so. Capturing the closest base to his main ma main base, and probably again he will just try to recruit units, defend that what he have right now, and after that crush crush with the iron first uh, Frezovsky units. But let's see, let's see how these times Slavs will respond. Okay, Frezovsky is approaching towards F. But only with his hero. Yep. Maybe he's just scouting. That's what I think so. Yeah, he's just scouting. He's gonna... ah, I thought he's gonna block capturing. Nah, but... It was close one. Look at that. Another Panzer Spearman crew is entering the fight. Okay, he's running. I was praying for Boleswav this time. Glad that he ran away. <gasps> but look, Frezovsky left him in the forest and the soldiers are chasing him. Okay, okay, he's running. I think he's baiting the, those units. Do you think so? Maybe. It seems so. Seems like Boleslav is dying. That's how it looks like for me. Is approaching. Okay, yep. Oh. They are chasing infantry. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Good play from Frazowski. This time, he didn't lost any unit. But look at the sea. I know he's capturing it. Yeah, and we have three units of... Kakas. Approaching, yep. But look, Frezovsky's flanking as well. He's sending support. And they will block capturing. Yep. Nice. But I'm not sure who is more powerful. Oh, okay. Clever, clever play by Kakas from London to yep. block uh, uh, those Spearmans. True. Oh, and he's losing again the shield warband. Yep. First blood. And in the meantime, the lone Panzer Spearman unit approaching the D. The D? No, no, they are going to support. I think so. Fight on. Uh... C, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Are they? No, oh, no, they are going to <laughs> fight on the, yep. But I think so, Frazowski have to give up on the. If he do not want to lose Boleslav and those spears. And he's still... I uh, didn't capture A. Yeah, and he's missing those shieldmen so much yeah. right now. Yeah. Attack! 
Oh, nice play from Kakao. Look what he's doing. He's cutting the reinforcements right now. And another cl clever infantry is joining. Yep. Okay, Rudolf is getting hit it by the watchtower. And look at that fight. That's what I'm talking right now uh, about. If we will have those shield uh, warband over here, I think Sofrazovsky will win it. Probably, yeah. Yeah, I think Sofrazovsky soon will have to evacuate all of his units. Oh, he is. The spear warband is dying. Almost dead. Yeah, almost. Okay, and Kakao is going back to finish what he started. To finish Boleslav and the spear warband. Okay, Boleslav survived. But the spear warband is going down. Yep. What is that Spear Warband doing? Okay, approaching on Rudolf. I see. Okay, the Watchtower is killing some of those units. Not anymore. Boleslav is rejoining the fight. Oh. Rudolf, meanwhile, reached level 2. And what do we have from Frazowski? Another Spear Warband, and that's it so far. Just two units of Spears and Boleslav. And the Blacksmith completed for Kakaos. Yep. Again, good start from Frazowski, but... I think so, Tides not, changed not on that. sea. Yeah, Tides changed on sea when he sacrificed that Shield Warband. Yeah, as, as Sekiro wrote, he doesn't miss a single chance to apply pressure. Exactly. He just knows where he needs to be. Yeah, and that's a bad situation for Slavs. Germans on one, two, three, four, five bases, farming, taking up, and preparing for final hit. Hmm. Not good for Razowski. Do not look like. It may be really quick match. Sekirido, yeah. Okay, Frazowski is finally going for A. I was wondering, not gonna lie, when he will finally cap it. Too late. A little too late. Yep. Kako already on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven units with the catapult against Frazowski on Boleslav and just one, two, three units. That's gonna hit. Be hard for Slavs, unfortunately. Okay, Frazowski is trying to flank a little bit. Spears versus Spears. Yep. But two units against one. Oh no, he managed to outflank them. <laughs> he tried to chase this. Oh, but... And Boleslav meanwhile dies, I think so, right? Yeah. Yeah, Boleslav dies. I just blinked and he, and he died. Ooh, Frazowski is getting demolished. Those spear. Yup.
and Kakaos is going for the warehouse. Yeah. He's producing only a speed warband. No shields, no chance. Yep. Just three units of spearmen. Seems like he has no power to stop that. And catapult, it's still not there. Okay, finally. Finally. It's the manas just standing there. Boom. The warehouse is going down. Oh, but look at that! Looks like Frozowski is going for the honor kill on Rudolf. <laughs> ah, yeah, yeah, but Rudolf managed to try to escape. <laughs> Rudolf is going back to his castle to tell about the beautiful, yeah, to write the books about this victory. Oh, and the shield warband out of nowhere is joining the fight. Lonely soldier is waiting to defend his hometown. But okay, we are going back to the action. It's, it's a GG. Yeah, Frizovsky already typed that GG. There is no chance. Well, you are a master, Frizovsky said. We should definitely speak with our development team to introduce some RNG, thunders, and things like that. <laughs> Which will help guys to win against Kakao's man then. Totally. Yeah. New prayers. And again, Rudolf is leading the charge. Blue tide incoming. <laughs> Even with the RNG, the man cannot be beaten. <laughs> but not gonna lie, the start of the first map looks really promising for the Frazowski. Yep. In this map, not gonna lie, from the beginning till the end, Kakaos was... Very, very solid with every move. You are speaking frenzy about uh, introducing the units out of the table? Like in Warhammer? <laughs> Yeah, let him finish. GG. GG, guys. What can I say? Both of us, me and Svetrovsky, we were hoping for map number three. But unfortunately, Mr. Kakaos Manden finished that in just two maps. Sadly. Not gonna lie, I would love to watch, uh, I would love to watch, uh, three maps on it. But we got really lovely two maps. Yeah, 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 yeah. As the boys say, unfortunately no one else is able to stand against Kakaos Manden. Let's see that one more time, guys, how Kakaos Manden achieved his glorious victory. Uh, where he started from? Show me that. At the beginning, he killed Anglo-Saxons, Vitruch. After that, he killed Vikings, Viking. After that, he killed as well Germans, Counter. And obviously, after that, DBG, another Germans in the semi-final. And in the final of the finals, 
killed Frazowski, who was playing Slavs. So to be honest, he played against every nation. Almost every nation. Yeah. That's how it was. But guys, do not forget about our second place guy, Mr. Frazowski, who was fighting really fucking brave in that final. And he killed Vikings during uh, his road. Who else you killed, Frazowski? Slavs? Okay, here, unfortunately, someone didn't appear on the match and in the beginning anglo-saxons so who knows guys maybe we found the weak spot of mr frazowski every time when you will play against mr frazowski seems like you have to use germans because that was the first match against germans for frazowski in that finale okay but guys this is the end this is the end of our beautiful journey through the community tournament uh, in Ancestors Legacy. Uh, thank you so much, everybody. Every you know what? I will read your nicknames. Thank you, Melkor. Thank you, Alba Solia. Gulashi Counter Viking. Decad Gul. Oh, I'm sorry, guys, if I'm pronouncing your nicknames wrong. Vitruch, Kakaos Menden, Staron, Frenzy, Dr. Proctor, Xart, Monitor, Menwi. Portos, Trader, who else on the right side? CTSS, Toilet Flusher, Olivox, Javix, Stilbert, Sardinka, Sam, Madvlad, DK, Cuervo Negro, Biku, Vampire Prince, Frezowski, Kurtz, Metcraft, Centurio, and our backup player, DBG. Thank you all for participating in our community tournament, guys. That was a pleasure to host it for you with Mr. Svetrovsky. Totally. Yeah, and we have one more important message uh, for you. Guys, at the beginning, we weren't announcing that you will receive some rewards um, for accomplishing position number one, position number two, etc. But during that entire tournament, uh, we were thinking about it. And with our development team, we decided that we will give rewards for not only for the glorious, victorious winners of our tournament, but as well for participants. But guys, this will be uh, a secret for a little bit longer. We'll let you know on our Discord what you will receive for participating in our tournament. And guys, obviously, we'll inform you through our Discord what our finalists will um, receive for obviously accomplishing such a high position uh, in this tournament. Thank you so much, guys, uh, for being here today with us. As I said, check out Discord. We will let you know probably tomorrow because today in Poland it's uh, almost midnight. So soon with uh, Svetrovsky we are going to sleep. But tomorrow we will wake up and at uh, and maybe at the 10 a.m. or something like that we'll let you know on the Discord what are the rewards. So yeah, <laughs> let's say it for one last time. Kakaos, the greatest warlord out there. Exactly. The second warlord, Frezowski. And the third warlord, DBG. But Stilbert was fighting really brave in uh, the second uh, final uh, for the third place as well. Not gonna lie. Thank you so much, guys. It was the pleasure. Thank you. See you on the Discord. And what can I say? Sleep well, warlords. Bye-bye. Kisses and hugs. Thank you.